Hello everyone, I'm creating this video to show you how do you do an import uh, of a part list into cut right. So I have a simple carcass over here. Okay, so over in this carcass, my parts has been named and what's just missing is the materials. So I'm just going to the materials palette to add uh, maybe plywood material. Okay, so when this material is added, okay, you're able to see that over in the attributes dialog, uh, plywood has been applied. <laughs> Next, we will go into the part list. And when I open up my part list for this cabinet, it will come out a default part list. But what I want to do is to create a new part list. Okay. This time, I select load default template. Sorry, I select select template. And I'll browse it to something where I have cut right. So this cut right can be downloaded at the command section. So just copy it to your desktop, open this cut right. So if you notice what happens here, there is the name of the parts, okay, the quantity, okay, there's the material code, there is the there is the thickness and the material. You can edit the column and you can see. Okay, you have the thickness and material. Okay, so over here, material thickness, you have the length with thickness. Okay, you can change this because all these are currently in German. Okay, because this is something that we have. And what happens is that this is the face coating. Okay, so what happens is that from here, we are able to export it. It has a CSV file. And in Cartwright, import this file over to Cartwright. So you shouldn't need to adjust any parameters because all these are done. So over in cut right, just make sure that your plywood, you need to have a material that has plywood. And in your plywood material library, you need to have 18mm and 9mm uh, libraries inside so that you are able to produce it. So I will try to change this cutting list into English and I will upload a revised cutting list. But in short, this is actually how you prepare a file to go into cut right just remember that you need to always apply a material code thank you